Hi friends! Today is going to be the year-end TBR tag. This tag was created by Margaret at The Word Nerd and I will link her video in the description box down below for you so that you may watch that as well. Part of the explanation for Margaret's original tag was that this is more of like building a end of the year TBR. So books that are on your list that you really want to get to by the end of the year. And also that you can, you know, answer more than one book per question. And also skip questions if you don't have anything that fits for that. I will go through all the questions. I don't have answers for some of them, but I'll at least say them so that you know what they are in case it interests you. A lot of these I don't have copies of yet. They're books that either are on their way to me or will be coming out soon or I have arcs of that are coming out soon. Okay so the first is what is a new release you need to read by the end of the year. Um, I have two for that. The first is A Lesson in Vengeance by Victoria Lee um, which I think is pretty big on booktube right now so most people kind of know that it's like a dark academia that's really all I know um, but I have that headed to me. And the other is A Curse in Ash by Julie Zantopoulos and Julie is a fellow booktuber and I will link her channel in the description box down below for you to peruse if you so choose as I always say. Um, and I have an arc of A Curse in Ash which I need to read very soon. Um, it's one of the next ones up on my list of things to read so I'll be getting to that. I know that it is an adult uh, fantasy fey story. It's really all I know going into it kind of blind. The second question which is one I don't have an answer for is what's a book that you want to reread? I don't think I have anything else this year that I plan to reread. So three is what is a series you want to continue? Uh, neither of these are out yet but they will both be out by the end of the year. The first is Well Matched by Jen DeLuca which is the third book in the Well Met series. Um, these are like set at a renaissance fair and follow uh, different couples each book. The other is Destiny of the Dead by Cal Cade, which is the sequel to Fate of the Fallen, which I read last year and really enjoyed. This series follows Oslo and Matthias. Um, Matthias is like the person who is destined to save the entire world and Oslo doesn't really have a future and he just decides to tag along with Matthias as he's going on his adventure uh, to save the world and very early on, like within a couple of chapters in Matthias dies and therefore Oslo decides to pick up his mantle and save the world even though Oslo is not destined to have any kind of a future. Four, what's a book you like to buddy read? I will be buddy reading with Beautifully Bookish Bethany's Patreon book club in October, The Haunting of Ashburn House by Darcy Coates. Very excited about that. We're also reading House of Leaves which I already read this year so I haven't decided if I'm going to reread it or not. Uh, if I do that would answer the reread question um, but it will just depend on how I'm going with my other reading because it is like an 800 page book, 710 pages and uh, I have a lot of other things I'd like to get to in October so I haven't decided on that one yet. The fifth question, not one that I have an answer for, what's an age category or genre that's different from what you usually read? I read a lot of things. I don't read like straight erotica I, and by that I don't mean I read not straight erotica. I mean I don't read stuff that is completely erotica and I don't read like children's picture books but I only plan to read either of those anytime soon so yay. Uh, a book from a previous TBR. I don't have anything anything that's kind of fallen off of the TBR has fallen off of the TBR and I don't really have any plans for any of those either. Uh seven. What is a book you recently purchased or acquired? I'm going with this Poison Heart by Kaylin Bayron. I keep forgetting who wrote it but it's gorgeous. Uh, this was an Alcrate book that I got last month and then um, one of the book of the month club books I got last month was Not a Happy Family by Shari Lapena and it's like an adult thriller mystery that sounded really good so I would like to read this in October. Next question. Books that are on your physical TBR. For that I picked two that I also plan to read in October. Um, the Project and the Ivies. The Project is by Courtney Summers. The Ivies is by Alexa Dunn who is a fellow author tuber who I will link in the description box down below. Um, both of these are like this is like an adult mystery. This is a YA mystery. Um, kind of dark academia. This involves a cult. So excited for both of these. Hyped books that you want to read. Uh, People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry. I really enjoyed Beach Read by Emily Henry. I also had an arc of this and I haven't read it yet. 
which means this would also probably work for a book that was on a previous TBR because I definitely need to get to this. Okay, moving on. Also Heartless by Marissa Meyer because I need to read this and I will have a vlog of reading this and four other books in a similar vein probably by the end of the year. And the last question is a book you previously DNF'd. I don't have any answers for that because I don't I don't really do soft DNFs really. Uh, every once in a while there's a book that'll soft DNF um, but there's usually like a reason like an emotional reason or you know something like that. I did kind of soft DNF at Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover but that was a few weeks ago so I'm definitely not ready to read that nor do I think I ever will be. Um, so there's nothing on my TBR for that. Okay that's gonna be it for me today. If you are interested in doing this tag again I've linked Margaret's video down below so you can check that out and all the questions are down below as well. Um, consider yourself tagged if you're watching this and it sounds like something fun that you would like to do. I don't have anybody specifically that I would like to tag. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, book, and planner related videos a couple times a week. If you don't want to miss anything happening in the future make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell down below and until then I will see you guys next time. Bye!